Hi guys, we are on the way to Belgium. Where are we going, Mark? We're going to Sutendal. Sutendal. Yeah. Hell on wheels. A lot of military vehicles. Yeah. Hopefully, hopefully it's got. It's going to be extremely hot. Um, actually, it's insane that we're even going. Yeah. It's it's um, it's just way too hot. Tomorrow is going to be the worst day ever, probably. We are planning to dig a foxhole near the, the forest, so see what we can do. We got all our stuff in the back, right there. All our military stuff. I got my Garand, and of course he's a medic, so he got his medic gear. And um, yeah, very, very excited. Hopefully uh, we're not gonna die because of the heat, but uh, we'll see. Yep, we're almost there, as you can see. It has to be over there on the left side. I think, I mean, I've never been here before. Hell on wheels. Yep, it's right here. There's a parking, but yeah. Uh, oh, they want us to come. All right. Control post. All right, so we are here for, I think, half an hour right now? Uh, maybe, maybe an hour? Maybe an hour, I don't know. It's extremely hot in the tent, so it's gonna be horrible. <laughs> probably not gonna sleep but as you can see this is an awesome place I'm gonna show you my tent later and of course Mark's tent and we are walking on uh, yeah the camp right now I have a big huge huge camp full of tents and vehicles military vehicles but this place is awesome just look around here look at this man what do you think yeah, this cool. is cool right <laughs> Wow Look at all this stuff. Look at all these trucks. A lot of beauties here. I like the barbed wire poles in the front. You see that? Sure. That's cool, the barbed wire pole. Oh, yeah. Hell on wheels. <laughs> yeah, it's hot. Now we are laughing probably later, not anymore. But at the moment, we are still laughing. And uh, yeah, that's why we are wearing our herringbone twill uniform. But still, very hot. but still very hot, but otherwise we would die immediately with the wool right now. Whew. I mean, it's in the evening and it's still hot, so tomorrow is going to be... Uh, I don't have words for it. Oh, look at that. Wow, man, look at all this. This is a uh, military air uh, field, right? Yeah. Military airfield. Yeah. That's where we are right now. This was an airfield during the Second World War from the United States Army. And there's still a uh, military airfield right there. It still is right now. Yeah. It was a battle and uh, an air battle right here, right as well, with uh, the German planes. They took German planes down here. Oh yeah. You know that? Yep. Oh well, they they had a battle here, right here. So yeah, a couple planes came down in this area. What do you think? Ah, it's pretty amazing. It's amazing, right? It's hot, but it's cool. Well, that's very stupid what I'm saying right now. <laughs> but you know what I mean. Alright, so we were just walking over a small uh, market right there. They're selling some stuff. And I just got recognized by uh, a subscriber. So how cool is that? So if you're watching right now, it was cool meeting you, and uh, yeah, we're gonna do some more stuff over here. I don't know what, it's very hot, and uh, the sun is shining. And the jeeps are rolling. All right, so here are our tents, and he is eating his stuff. Some biscuits. Some nice. biscuits from his K-ration, right? Yeah, very nice K-ration. And um, yeah, some nice biscuits. Um, yeah, we're gonna sleep in here. It's very hot, so we're not allowed to make fire, which is a problem, because now, I can't make my sausages and I can't uh, make my coffee, etc, etc. So that's not so nice, but um, yeah, we have to live from the water and the biscuits and I think that's it. Yeah, we're not going to buy french fries, are we? I mean, they're selling them over there, but nope. We're going to just uh, live from the rations here. And uh, well, right now there's a gentle breeze. Look at that. That's so cool, but yeah, the weather is pretty nice right now. Um, I don't know if we're gonna walk a patrol 
today? Maybe? Probably, Probably not. not. You can just smell the oil from the from the military vehicles everywhere here. We're just, you know, they're everywhere. So this is this is amazing. Yeah, right now I'm gonna eat something. Okay, so I just unpacked my stuff. You can see this Hershey bar that I made. Hershey's tropical chocolate. Looks pretty cool. So uh, yeah, of course it's real chocolate. So that's nice. Um, we got this can opener. Got some of these Knäckebrot crackers thingies. Use army field ration chunks of pineapple, which is nice. And uh, as you saw before, I'm not gonna use the uh, pull tab. I'm just gonna use this opener to make it historically correct. And here's all my stuff. Well, there's a lot more in there, but yeah. Too bad we can't use uh, the cooking stove thingy because I would love some coffee right now. Right? But no, we can't do it. I mean, I was thinking about maybe to do it right in there, sneaky, but no, 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 we're not gonna do it. We really, we really don't wanna start a fire. I'm just gonna open my can right now. Constantly, vehicles driving by. Oh, here's my other ration. Wish me luck opening this thing. Ooh, nice hiss. Let's get it in a tray. Nice. <laughs> Oh man, I couldn't resist. Again, pieces of paint. How nice. Wasp. There's a wasp. Oh, I can see it. Uh-oh. There's a wasp right here. So, probably likes my chunks of pineapple. Yeah. But we are not afraid of a small wasp, are we? Uh, well, I am. Are you? You don't like them? No. Nope. Are you um, nope. allergic for them? No. I'm making it so hard for myself. I could just rip it apart, but nope. I have to be historically correct, so I have to open it like this. But yeah, that's why we're here, right? There we go. We open it up. Hey, you want a chunk of pineapple? Uh, Just one. To try. Haha. <laughs> I think you. There you go. Cheers, guys. Pineapple. Mmm. Good stuff, huh? Yeah. Want another one? Enough? That is awesome. Look at that. And there she goes. Beautiful. That's a big truck. Enjoying your drink? Oh yeah. Nice and refreshing. Yeah, nice and cold. Coca-Cola. Yeah, right here in the sun it's very, very hot. Yeah. It's really burning and it's evening, man. Oh man. So it's gonna be very, very hot tomorrow. They got a very cool clubhouse here, right over here. Hell on wheels, so that's pretty awesome. They got a lot of guns hanging on the wall. And my rival just laying casually on the table. Ah, watching the vehicles. With ice cream, nice. Just uh, chilling right there. Okay, so we are going on patrol right now. Of course, I can't film while we are on patrol. We have our combat gear, rifle, Thompson. Um, he is a medic, so no weapons, of course. But he got all his stuff. And uh, we're gonna leave the, the haversack and stuff in the tent and we're just gonna do a patrol, so. Goa, too tall, to the next line of logs. Ready, go. Ready, cover, okay? You 
Okay, James. You right? Ah, f***. Ah, Stay down, sniper. Can you walk? Stay down, James. Go, go, go. Don't get shot, man. No. I'm not trying to kill you. No. Stay low. Are you okay, Sarge? Yeah, I'm fine. Can you walk? I'm gonna try it. Sarge, can you move? Where are you hit? It's the f***ing leg. He's hitting his leg. Treat him, he's, le he's bleeding, man. Come on. Stay low. Put some bandage. Ah, it's it's a it's stay low, stay low, it's a sniper. Oh, f Doc, take it easy, but no, fucking leg. Like watch out, watch out. Move them, move them. Oh, fucking hell. Ah, are you sure you stopped the fucking bleeding because it still fucking hurts? Put your helmet on. Uh, Is it completely through? I think it did. Yeah. And. Hey, that sniper is somewhere there, over there. Stay down. Okay, wait. wait, wait. I'm dropping Thompson. What are you looking for? They're shooting! Get down. Okay, the sniper is over there. In the back? Yeah, he's somewhere there on that side. I'm not sure where it comes from. There's a German sniper over there. They're treating us one. Right there. I'm staying low. Sorry, sir. Where is the sniper? He's over there in that direction. I don't think he can see us from now, from here. He's probably changing his position. He's somewhere over there. Where the f is he? He went AWOL, sir. What? Just like last time, situation. What? You okay, Sarge? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Joe, how about that morphine, Doc? Well, you're not. You're not you're getting not morphine yet. Yeah, so hock. suck it up, Sarge. We suck need to it get up, Sarge. I got that shot. For fuck's sake. Ready? Get up your ass. You can, you can ah, don't. And put Doc, me on my, you my canteen is under my ass. You go to the, to the edge of the forest. Yeah. Oh, it is. Yeah. yeah? Ready? You guys need to move. This copper is moving Okay, I'll around. be there. Right, we need to get out of here, guys. Come on. Where did Kukua go? We need to take out that sniper. Go to the, to that edge. Guys, we need cover. Yeah. yeah. Alright, give me cover fire. I'm pretty sure the shot came from over there. In that direction. But I'm not really sure where it was. I thought yeah. it was coming from that way. We're gonna go over into that area. We okay. cover. Yeah, we really do. On the double, right now. Ready? Come on. Go. To the bottom and you can cover. On the last. I'll cover, I'll cover you guys. We're sitting ducks here. Yeah. We're we really need to move here. now. We need to move. Too tall. Ready? You go. Uh, on your mark. Try and find the cola, though. Ready? Go. Give me the pistol belt. It's yours. Okay. I can't go after. Who's next? You. I'm, I'm the smallest, not the last. Doc? Huh? Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. Go. Okay. Yes. I'm gonna clear that house over there. That house? That building over there. One more building. Okay. Stay on my ass.
Back. Back. Okay. What is that? I'm not sure. I don't trust this place. We're too much in the open. Yeah. This mother f went away. I should like to know, Sarge. For sure. Okay. Yeah? Shh. I heard something right there. You heard that too? Yeah. Okay, so something is moving around in the bushes. It's pretty close. Taking the road. James? Yeah. That was scary, huh? Yeah. Hiding in the woods. It's much more safer there. You okay? I'm okay. Where the f were you? I was hiding in the woods. You were hiding in the woods? And then suddenly I heard something, so I was. Behind a fallen tree. We didn't know where you were, goddammit. No? No. You better explain me what you did, because otherwise we're going to court-martial you. I heard, I heard something, yeah? I heard something. So I was hiding in the woods because we were in an open field. And I know that this I place was safe. I swear to God. This was the last time. Next time I'm going to court-martial you. Sarge, you better take care of this mother Yeah, we'll do After a long march. made my tent right now and uh, making some sausages as you can see getting warm already using my uh, s bit burner Ooh, look at that nice and where's my fork ah here's my fork <laughs> not sure if I'm gonna sleep tonight but we'll see I'm pretty sure these are ready oh wow Whoa. look at that it's all inside my tent oh. oh man I can see what I'm doing hot sausages Hmm. Hello there. Let me tell you a very scary story about Germans in the forest. The 
they want your sausages. Mmm. Tomorrow's gonna be a hard day, probably, because of the heat. Good evening, sir. Good evening. Do you see my sausages? Yeah. Looks tasty. Yeah, tasty, huh? <laughs> Look at that. Mmm. Salsa jazz. It's time to sleep. Um, I'm gonna try to sleep. I have no pillow. I don't know what I'm gonna do, how I'm gonna sleep, but uh, <laughs> we're gonna find out on the grass here. It's five o'clock in the morning. And you guess it, no sleep at all. You can hear someone snoring right next to me. It's cold. Well, it was a horrible night. It's gonna be a very hot day, but right now at this moment, it's very cold. I'm only wearing my summer herringbone twill. It's very thin, so yeah, it's cold. There's the sun. <sighs> yeah, it's six o'clock right now, but I'm not just gonna keep laying here because I'm just not going to sleep at all. The only thing I'm doing right now is hurting my body. <laughs> all my muscles are hurting. I think I'm gonna eat something. I'm just gonna make some coffee. Everything is wet. I could really use some coffee right now. Milk and sugar. That's nice. Oh man, it's absolutely horrible to spend hours in a tent like this without sleeping. I can feel the sun through the canvas and I can still hear snoring right next to me. I'm listening to the snoring for hours right now. I really wished I had slept as well. Good morning, lads. <laughs> so, you've been sleeping? Um, yeah, you said I, I slept. Well, I heard him the whole night long, so <laughs> yes, I, uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, a lot. I, I hope I have it on camera. Yeah, well, I hope to. <laughs> I was like, oh no, I can't sleep. And all the time I, 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 was, I heard you. I'm sorry. I was like, oh man. It's the I'm second time. So jealous. It kept you awake, right? Uh, no, well. The no, trench also. Kept, well, kept the ground awake. kept me awake, actually. So yeah, what do you got there? Still. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We are packing all our stuff right now for uh, the vehicle parade. Yeah, yeah. 
Alright, so we were driving and um, I wasn't really feeling well. The water that we take here is not the best water and uh, I was feeling pretty sick. We were driving in the trucks and my grand belt was constantly pushing in my stomach. Not enough food, not enough water and I actually puked in my helmet. <laughs> it was a long ride. I mean, I feel like I can go on right now but I just don't think it's smart. I just think I have to stop right now. It's it's hot and go marching now, not a good idea. So uh, yeah, that's it for today. The sun is really burning and um, I had no sleep at all. So no sleep, not enough food, not enough water and this heat and then in a truck like that, well, that's just a mixture of badness. Okay, so that was two weeks ago. Uh, like I explained before, I just wasn't feeling well. The water there had a very weird taste, so I just didn't have enough water. No food, no sleep, the burning sun, I was just boiling inside my helmet. And then in the back of a truck a couple hours, uh, very rough terrain. Later it was even worse. I couldn't film that because I was scared that I would lose my camera. Yeah, through puddles of mud and stuff. Uh, it was a very very cool experience and yeah, I puked two times in my helmet. I'm not gonna puke outside the truck because there was a vehicle driving behind us and I didn't want to puke on it. So, <laughs> so I decided to just put my helmet off very quick, take out the liner and I puked in my helmet. Actually very funny. Just threw it out the side, whoop, later again. So, <laughs> so two times and um, there wasn't even much to puke because it was just a little bit of water. Not much. Not, not, no food at all. Just no food at all. Some tiny pieces of chocolate. Um, so yeah, uh, a very funny experience and I'm very sure that it happened during World War II as well. I mean if you're just feeling tired and you're in the back of a truck like that, uh, wobbling like that, yeah, you're just gonna feel sick. It was a uh, very, yeah, let's call it special. Now I can officially say that I puked in an original US World War II M1 helmet while in the back of a World War II truck. This weekend there is going to be another event, but I don't think I'm gonna film there because we are the entertainment and soldiers weren't really walking with modern cameras like that during World War II. And uh, it was also very cool that I met a couple subscribers. They recognized me, so uh, yeah, that's just awesome. All right, that's gonna be it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed. If you did like the video, please leave a like and a comment. If you have any questions, feel free to ask and subscribe if you wanna see more videos. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.